Hey guys, welcome back to Sissy's Savories and Sweets. I'm getting ready to start supper. It's um, 10 to five and Sarah's coming over with Jessica. And I just got home from work and it's been a super busy day. I had a class today. So if Andrea, if you come on and you're watching this, this is supper. This is what I was showing you earlier. I'm gonna show you guys how to make a version of chicken parmesan. Now this is not the traditional chicken parm. This is not in a red sauce. I'm putting this in a lemon sauce because I love lemon and chicken, but it's the same basic techniques and this is going in the IP. You can do this in the air fryer, you can bake in the oven, you can do it in the frying pan, however you want to do your chicken. But these are some real, yes, I got my hair done. <laughs> Tiffany asked if I got my hair done. Yes, I got my hair done. That bangs cut in and yeah. So anyway, um, just the real, and when you have a small space, do things ahead to prep. So I prepped ahead. So, um, my, let me just turn this off real quick. My husband's making iced tea. So, um, let me flip the camera. I had my IP on saute. So, preheat your IP if you're gonna use your IP. If you're gonna air fry, you know, you can get your air fryer. But let me just adjust the camera. So, oh, you're so cute. Okay, so what I did is this. And that's my IP saying it's heating. Okay, can you all see this? I hope so. Let me just do some adjusting here. Maybe. This will be a learning curve as I learn to see what angles you guys can see. Okay. Um, this, this so in this bowl, this is my egg wash, basically. It's my glue. Uh, and again, if you guys comment, I can't see what you comment until afterwards. So I'm making a version of chicken parm. I'm going to do a lemon sauce. Forgot one thing. Nope, I'm gonna do it later. So this is just eggs they whipped up and lots of garlic, okay? So this is the glue. This is panko breadcrumbs. And again, more garlic and salt and parsley. So your seasonings are in here. And just to make sure I'm gonna have enough seasoning because that's your, that creates like flavor. Let me just check my oil here. Um, I'm gonna add a little more of my garlic salt. I'm doing this dairy-free, so that's about three tablespoons total of the garlic seasoning. I'm gonna pull part of that out once I mix it up, because Sarah can't have dairy. So what's gonna go in here is Parmesan cheese. So I'm gonna take part of this back for Sarah's chicken. And I have dairy-free parm for her. So I'm um, gonna just show you guys. You can get this in most stores. There is a dairy-free Parmesan cheese for those that can't have dairy. But I'm using real parm today for those of us that can have it. And again, watch the oil on your IP because it will heat up really quickly. Oh, there we go. So I'm gonna put about, I don't know. You know me, I'm measuring you guys, I'm sorry. Half cup of really good Parmesan cheese in here. Okay. This is not gonna be a tomato parm. This is gonna be in a lemon sauce when I get done with it because we love lemon. I have three large chicken breasts on the board that I cut up. So take your chicken. I got my tongue somewhere too. Okay. We'll see which one works easier. I sometimes just use my fingers. Take your chicken, coat it in your egg and your garlic. Remember, all your flavoring is in that bowl right there. Dip it in there, get it nice and coated and happy. Some people double egg, double dip it. You don't need to do that because you can see it's got a good coating on there. I've got a pan ready here to put the chicken on. This is gonna actually fry in the, air, in the IP and then it's going to cook once it gets done. I just turned the IP off to not let it overheat the oil. So again, egg. Your breadcrumb garlic parmesan mixture. This is so quick and so easy. You'll just be going. And you can make chicken fingers like this too in your in your air fryer. This is enough for four people. It's big breasts. Make sure you have it well coated. So I'm just gonna do a couple of these to show you guys. I'll do one more and I'll go over to my front my IP. 
Again, you can do these on your stove top. You can do these in your oven. You can do these in your air fryer. But literally, this dinner will be done in minutes. I'm serving this over rice. I'm gonna make a really yummy lemon sauce to go with it. Keith is not a fond of lemon, so I'm not gonna make lemon for him. But the nice coat. If you don't like to use your fingers, use your tongue, use a fork. Okay, there's four. So I'm just gonna wipe my fingers off real quick. So I want you guys to, uh, let me see if I can move the camera so you can see the camera, see the air from the IP. So, my oil is hot, you guys. Be careful to not overheat your oil. I did turn it off, I'll put it back on. Your IP will do a lot of your work for you. So I'm just gonna put that in. And while that gets a quick coating, a quick, quick color, I'm going to, this will give it a nice, oh, let me just adjust the camera. So you guys can see this. So you can fry in your IP. I don't mean deep fry, but you could. I don't deep fry. But I'm gonna get that chicken some nice color on there. And again, I can't see your comments, so forgive me, I'll catch them later. And then what I'm gonna do with this once it gets done is I'm gonna cook it in some chicken broth and then get that done the rest of the way. I'm gonna make some rice and then I'm going to um, make a lemon sauce. So what I'll probably do, because you guys don't need to watch, let's see. Where do you find your dairy-free foods? Okay, um, Luke, are you from, I care you live in the area, so Lucan's carries a lot of dairy-free products now. So I bought the Parmesan cheese at Lucan's. Um, Harmony is also another good source for dairy-free choices. So um, I'm gonna make another batch of this with the dairy-free parm. It tastes just the same, just that Sarah can't have dairy. So um, those are the two local places. Target also has a small selection of dairy-free. There are some choices there. Let me see what else I missed for questions. Love the hair, you guys are so funny. Yes, the hair is, I need to get this done so bad. So my hairdresser is a miracle worker. Okay, um, you guys, quick, easy supper. So what's gonna happen with this is I'm gonna finish making it golden brown, GBD. Golden brown and delicious. And like I said, you can do this in your air fryer. You can do this on your, the cheese is getting all ooey gooey. Um, you can do this on your stove top. You can bake it in the oven. That needs just a couple more minutes of brownness. And then I'm gonna add some chicken stock to this. And then that will finish cooking the chicken. And then I'm gonna make the sauce out of it. So you'll have a lemon, garlic parmesan chicken so um i'm not gonna let you sit here and finish watching chicken cook but when i get done i'll come back on i'll show you how it looks done and easy easy chicken once you get done frying it it's like a five minute cook time because you fried it so i cooked it already just make sure you temp your chicken if you're not positive on it but i'll come back live and i'll show you finish pocketing so happy cooks cook with love catch you later